The Life and Sad Ending of Will Gear. Will Gear, born William Og Gear, was born March 9, 1902, in Frankfort, Indiana, the son of Catherine, a teacher, and Roy Aaron Gear, a postal worker. His father left the family when he was 11 years old. He was deeply influenced by his grandfather, who taught him the botanical names of the plants in his native state. Gear started out to become a botanist, studying the subject and obtaining a master's degree at University of Chicago. While at Chicago, he was a member of the Lambda Chi Alpha fraternity. Anglicizing his name, Gear began his acting career touring in tent shows and on riverboats. He worked on several left-oriented documentaries, including narrating Sheldon Dick's Men and Dust, about silicosis among miners. His Broadway debut happened in 1928, with Much Ado About Nothing. He appeared in other plays such as The Cradle Will Rock and Of Mice and Men. Gear performed with Group Theater in New York and came under the tutelage of Cheryl Crawford, Harold Clearman, and Lee Strasberg. He earned a Tony Award nomination in 1964 for the Best Featured Actor in a Musical, for his performance in 110 in the Shade. During the 1930s, he toured with government work camps of the Civilian Conservation Corps, accompanying folk singers such as Woody Guthrie and Burl Ives. Gear and Guthrie became friends and released an album named Bound for Glory, Songs and Stories of Woody Guthrie in 1956. Back in 1934, Gere became a member of the Communist Party of the United States. He met gay rights activist Harry Hay that year while working at the Tony Pastor Theater. Gere became romantically involved with Hay and remained an influential in introducing the latter to the operations of the Communist Party. Hay considered Gere his political mentor and participated in a milk strike in Los Angeles with Gear in 1934. While participating in the San Francisco general strike, the two witnessed the police firing on the strikers and causing the death of two. They supported the 83-day-long 1934 West Coast waterfront strike. Greer also served the West Coast communist newspaper, People's World, as a reader. Then he played Mephistopheles, the devil, in Norman Corwin's radio play, The Plot to Overthrow Christmas, in 1938 and 1944. He also portrayed Penny in the radio soap opera Bright Horizon, which ran from 1941 through 1945. Next, he appeared in movies such as Winchester 73, 1950, Broken Arrow, same year, and Bright Victory, 1951. His career, however, took a back seat after Gear was blacklisted in the early 1950s for refusing to testify before the House Committee on Un-American Activities. As a result, Gear appeared in very few films over the next decade. Gear gradually revived his entertainment career with some memorable performances. He appeared as Bear Claw Chris Lapp in the 1972 blockbuster hit Western Jeremiah Johnson which was featured at the 1972 Cannes Film Festival. He also played Zebulon Grandpa Walton in the first six seasons, 1972 through 1978, of The Waltons. In 1975, he won the Emmy Award for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Drama Series for the role. His death after the show's sixth season led it to kill his character in the script. The death of his character was written into the show's script, and his final episode, the last episode of the 77-78 season, depicted his being reunited with his on-screen wife, Esther, played by Ellen Corby. In his personal life, he married American actress and political activist Herta Ware in 1934. Actress Herta Ware was best known for her performance as the wife of Jack Guilford in the film Cocoon, in 1985. Gear and Ware had three children, Kate, Tad, and Ellen. Although Gear and Ware eventually divorced, they remained close for the rest of their lives. 
As Will Gear was dying in April 22, 1978, of respiratory failure at the age of 76, his family sang Woody Guthrie's This Land is Your Land and recited poems by Robert Frost at his deathbed. Gear's remains were cremated. His ashes are buried at the Theatricum Botanicum in the Shakespeare Garden in Topanga Canyon near Santa Monica, California.